Hello and welcome. I hope that you are having a fantastic day. Today we're going to look at Bitcoin news and in the news today is you can buy Coke, Coca-Cola with Bitcoin. There's a whole bunch of vendors throughout Australia and Austria and a number of other countries, New Zealand, that have implemented a add-on to their uh, uh, vending machines where you buy a can of Coke or some other soda or pop, depending on where you live. And uh, you can use Bitcoin. It actually gives you a, a little uh, 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 QR code and you scan the QR code with your app and that allows you to buy that, that soda or pop or can of Coke with Bitcoin. But we're not going to stop there. We're going to look at 14 places where you can spend your Bitcoin today. Pretty cool. So should I buy Bitcoin now or should I wait? That's a great question. And we're going to help you get information to help you make a good decision in that area. We're going to give you ideas to help you take profits and avoid losses. Can we get 99 likes on this video? Smash the like button. It helps us out uh, unbelievably. We will be eternally grateful uh, just because you smashed the like button. So disclaimer, now I am not a financial advisor and this is not financial advice. This is my opinion. And the reason why I tell you that is, is I want you to be able to do your own research. You, you need to look into things for yourself and make your own decision based on what you believe. Because what I believe is good for me, but what I believe may not be good for you. And so every person's individual circumstances is different. And I want to help you make a good decision for your individual circumstances. But because I don't know you intimately, I don't know all the ins and outs of your finances, of your family, of what's important to you, what your goals and your objectives are, et cetera, et cetera. And because I'm not trained as a financial advisor, I can't help you in that way. But I can give you ideas and information that I've learned that may help you make your own conclusions. And so that's really the intent of what we're trying to do. And always remember, cryptocurrency involves substantial risk of loss. So read the rest of this disclaimer. It actually is very applicable no matter what you're investing into. It's, it's, just, it's just plain old good advice. So let's take a look at this. I, want, I, 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 I like to show this because a lot of people focus so much on day trading or short-term trading that they may actually be losing money in the process. And so what I'm sharing with you is a simple strategy to make money from Bitcoin. And that simple strategy is you invest whatever amount of money. I'm just using $1,000 so that we can actually show some numbers. But whether it's $10, 10,000, or 100,000, whatever amount, invest in Bitcoin and hold on to it for three years. Don't do anything with it for three years. So examples of what would have happened if you did $1,000, if you bought a $1,000 worth of Bitcoin on January 1, 2017 and sold it three years later on December 31st, 2019, you would have received $7,206 for that Bitcoin. And you can see that the numbers go from the spectacular 2.6 million uh, to the less interesting at $1,180. Now, but, you know, really keep it in mind that $1,180, that's still 18% over three years. That's not bad. That's far better than the interest that you would have gotten if you just put it into a regular old savings account at a bank. All right. So Decrypt ran an article today and the article is entitled, You Can Now Buy Coke with Bitcoin Down Under. There's 12,000 Coca-Cola vending machines in Australia and New Zealand now accept Bitcoin. Woohoo! All right, so let's take a look at it. So I just told you about the first one. 
Um, but some of the others, and these were not in the article I just showed you, but I will leave you a link to the article I showed you and to articles where I got this information out of so that if you want to do more research, you'll find those links in the YouTube description. So Global POS, which produces point-of-sale systems for retailers, plans to roll out crypto payments to 25,000 French stores this year. 2019 was when this was written. Among them, Decathlon, Sephora, and Foot Locker. So this may have already happened. I didn't see an update, otherwise I would have included that. All 6,000 7-Eleven stores in the Philippines now offer cryptocurrency purchases. Over 10,000 French convenience stores sell crypto. The German branch of the fast food restaurant chain Burger King now claims to accept Bitcoin as a payment for its online orders and deliveries. With over 50,000 takeaway restaurants listed on its United Kingdom-based site, Order Takeaways is one of the surest ways to get a pizza paid for with crypto delivered to your doorstep. Now this one I thought was really interesting. Richard Branson's space tourism company, Virgin Galactic, started accepting Bitcoin as payment as far back as 2013. Wow, talk about an early starter. So Richard Branson, you know, he's, he's quite wealthy. He's a billionaire. He obviously had a certain amount of vision for Bitcoin if he was allowing people to pay for uh, trips to space in his space tourism company in 2013. Imagine if you had bought uh, one of those trips in 2013, how much that Bitcoin is worth today. Wow. A brick-and-mortar American jewelry company called Reed's Jewelers accepts Bitcoin for both its physical and online stores. The Gift mobile gift card app allows Bitcoin to be used to purchase gift cards from several retailers, some of which include Burger King, Subway, Amazon, and Starbucks. Travel by Bit, a flight and hotel booking service, accepts cryptocurrencies like Bitcoin, Binance Coin, and Litecoin as payment. Other platforms to book flights with crypto include Destinia, Cheap Biz Class, Cheap Air, Air Baltic, Bitcoin, um, oh, Bitcoin Travel, and a Bit Sky, among others. Then in May 2019, Five Star Hotel and Spa, Doddler Grand, announced that it will start accepting Bitcoin and Ether as payments. And platform for gadget junkies include Newegg, iBoat. Microsoft, Fast Tech, and Alza, and there were 7,722 Bitcoin ATMs globally as of May 2020. And so, wow, that is a much bigger list than I anticipated, but the list is growing bigger every day. So, this is not a comprehensive list, not by any means. There's many, many other places out there that you can spend your Bitcoin. In fact, something I didn't even put on the, on the list here is there's a number of exchanges that will send you a debit card and the debit card acts like a Visa or MasterCard and so you could spend the Bitcoin on, that you have on that exchange anywhere you wanted to. And many of those exchanges that give you debit cards allow you to spend a multitude of different cryptocurrencies. You just go into the software in advance and then you pick which, which crypto you want to spend on your debit card. And then every time you make a transaction, the exchange converts that to cash in order to pay the uh, uh, retailer because the retailer gets, gets the money just as if you had used a regular Visa card, MasterCard, debit card. Um, and so pretty, pretty amazing things. You know, we've always talked for years about how Bitcoin is money and we can see that growing by leaps and bounds every year. There's more and more opportunities to be able to use Bitcoin and other cryptocurrencies, uh, to buy goods and services. So that is my video today. How can I be of service to you? Do you have any questions, thoughts, comments? Maybe you disagree with something I said today. Hey, I would love to hear your polite disagreements in the comment section below. Look, I know you know things I don't know. 
And there's things that I know that you don't know. So when we share what we know with each other, we'll both grow smarter. I'm interested in growing smarter together with you. So I hope that you'll share what you know or share your questions, comments, thoughts in the comment section. In the meantime, do me a favor, like, subscribe, and hodl, and I hope that you have a fantastic day.